religious or non-religious, this is very, very important. And please, please make sure that you share this video so many people will be benefiting from it. My dear brothers and sisters, today we're going to be talking about, for the past weeks, we were talking about the description of a live heart, a heart that is living, a heart that is fearing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, a heart that is in, in that that it's 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 uh, sensitive when it when it sees something wrong it cries when it when it de- do something wrong it's affected and it regrets today my dear respect brothers we're going to be talking about the description of a hard heart a hard heart a heart that uh, the heart that is does not feel a heart that does not does not s- sense its surrounding there is an important saying by by Malik ibn Dinar, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be pleased with them, what he said, he said, inna lillahi uqubat, indeed Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have several ways of punishment, fil qulubi wal abdan, when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he punishes us, sometimes he punishes us with, 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 with things on our heart and on our bodies, dankun fil ma'isha, sometimes he, he would make our, our uh, provision is less, or make our life, you know, make our life have some trouble, وَوَهْنٌ فِي الْعِبَادَةِ Sometimes we are lazy to, to worship him. وَمَا ضَرَبَ بِعَبْدٌ بِعُقُوبَةِ أَعْظَمُ مِنْ قَسْوَةِ الْقَلْبِ He says there is, no, there is no worse punishment. Look at this. There is no worse punishment that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would punish an individual worse than what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would make that individual heart hard. It's not, not affected. It is, it's, it's not it's it's not a uh, uh, sensitive heart the opposite a hard a very hard heart Allah you know according to to, to Malik ibn Dinar, ibn Dinar it is the worst punishment why why is that my dear respect brothers because the heart is there is for it to feel the reason why it's living the heart is there so it could it enjoy it's it's life in this earth by worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala not a heart that is Running after its uh, luxuries and uh, and running after running after worldly things and not running after other, their own desire. That's the whole point of the heart. The heart is there for it to to be. It, it's, it's, a, it's a it's a very sensible organ, and that's why Allah Subhanahu wa Taala when He described yani in, in, in another in another uh, saying by Hudayfa al Ma'arishi. This is what he, this, this man said. He said. ما أصيب أحد بمصيبة أعظم من قساوة القلب. There is no disaster worse than someone having what, having a very hard, harsh heart. Why? Because the, I mean, this is people sometimes think of like the worst punishment. You know, the, the 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 you know that that someone would die or you have a, an accident or your heart or your your house is burned down. People think this is the worst kind of punishment that God would give give us. But no, for people who truly think. For people who truly think is having a hard heart is worse because now you, you know all these materialistic things can be replaced but when you have somebody have a have a hard heart how could you replace that when you are just like another another creation when you when, when you are just like an animal or some or, or or a cattle how could how could you change that you know you are nothing like like you know like a table or a wall, or or a you know you you you're not you become insensible. You, you don't you don't become a human being anymore, and that's why that's considered to be a hard, a, a, a very bad punishment. When Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says in the Quran, "ثم قصت قلوبكم فهي كالحجارة أو أشد قسوة." When Allah Subhanahu wa Taala describes the people of Bani Israel, He said, the, the, "Your heart have became hard." But you know what? Even even the stones are even better. You know. Because and Allah Subhanahu wa Taala says, and he, he said, he said, he said, he said, sometimes the stones can be even better than your heart, than your heart, you know, because because the, you know water could come out of the, the, the stones, you know, uh, sometimes the, the stone would fall out from the sky out of mercy of Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, sometimes the, the, the stones fear Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, but some people, uh, my dear respect brothers, says, their heart is even even worse. It's even worse, you know. Subhanallah, yani, and 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 th- and th- this is this is this is yani, This is, you know, the 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 problem when Allah Subhanahu wa Taala describe when Allah Subhanahu wa Taala describes certain people, and he and 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 he described them and he said, وَأَحَاطَتْ بِهِ ذُنُوبُ وَأَحَاطَتْ بِهِ خَطِيئَةُ and his 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 sins surrounded him. His sins 
surrounded him. Why is that? When someone, my, my dear respect, brothers, says he continue, he he. Uh, he he continued to to commit sins, commit sins, commit sins, commit sins, and to, to the point that he, you know he he's he, he's not he's not regretting what he's doing. He's he's still you know going um, going by everything that he's doing. And and what happened? You know, his sins become around him. You know, it 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 it, it becomes it, it makes him, it would make him blind. It would make him blind that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is looking at him. It make him blind that 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 that, that yeah, that nothing really affect him. He becomes like a person without any hearing, without any he- without 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 lifting and etc. You know? And that's why Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says that when, that when a person commit a sin, he have no iman. Why? Because his iman would leave him. He said, La 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 zani hina yazni wa mu'min. Like when someone commits zina, adultery, he does not have any iman. When someone drink Alcohol. He does not have iman while he's doing it because he's blind. He's not. He's not thinking straight. He's. He. He. He, he is. He. He's. 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 You know. His drive is not his. What he sees, or what he feels, or what he sees. His main drive is what his own desires. His main drive is his own desire. He. 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 He become blind whatsoever. And also, my dear respect or sisters, we say. This is one of the worst diseases, is when someone have what? A hard heart. Now, let's talk about, my dear respect brothers and sisters, um, uh, what, what are the descriptions? What are some of the descriptions when someone have a hard heart? Okay? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, قُلْ أَرَأَيْتُمْ إِنْ أَخَذَ اللَّهُ سَمْعَكُمْ وَأَبْصَارَكُمْ وَخَتَمَ عَلَىٰ قُلُوبِكُمْ مَنْ إِلَاهٌ غَيْرُ اللَّهُ if have you ever seen have you ever seen um, um, pe- people who Allah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have taken their hearing who Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have taken their sight away and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have stamped on their heart why what when did this happen this happened my dear respect brothers and sisters and this is one of the most important description of a hard heart is when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would stamp their heart and what happened they become they, they don't become they don't see okay and what happened and they don't hear okay you know and and subhanallah yani, this is this is what, the, the worst description because yani, when someone was all his life is full of sins when their life is full of sins you advise them you think they're gonna listen to your, the, to your advice you show them the truth you think they're gonna follow the truth you tell them read it is, it is, it is, you think they're going to read? You tell them, read the Quran. You think they're going to be affected by the Quran? No. Because all, they, 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 they're, they're, yes, they see, but they don't see in reality. They hear, but they don't, and, and they don't hear, you know? And, and, and that's why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, when He described people who, who don't hear and they don't see, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, وَفِي آذَانِهِمْ وَقُرَىٰ And the, in their, 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 their ears, you know? There is nothing, there is no, they cannot hear. They cannot hear. وَلَوْ عَلِمَ اللَّهُ فِيهِمْ خَيْرًا لَأَسْمَعَهُمْ وَلَوْ أَسْمَعَهُمْ لَتَوَلَّوْ وَهُمْ مُعْرِضُونَ And even if they hear, they're not, they're, they're not like a normal human being that would hear. Why? Because, 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 you know, again, something else is taking precedence. You know, their desire is, 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 uh, is, is, is to them is more important. Allah, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, in a very in a, in a, in, a, in a hadith, he said, "Wailun lil aqba' al qawl." Wailun, woe to those who hear an advice and it come in one end and it would leave another end. He said, he, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Woe to them." And how many times we see this? We, we advise people, we tell them, they hear the truth, they, they come to lectures, they're hearing us, and they come to Jum'ahs, and absolutely, as they enter Jum'ah, they would leave it, and there is nothing, nothing have ever have changed them. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, said, woe to them, you know. وَيْلُ لِلْمُشْرِّينَ الَّذِينَ يُسْرُونَ عَمَا فَعْلُوا هُمْ يَعْمَلُونَ Woe for those people who does what? Who continue committing the same sins, and, and, and even people, people advise them, and they don't even care. So my dear respect brothers, this is important. And we have, when we see this, we have to kind of evaluate ourselves. Are we the ones that people advise us and we don't listen? Are we the ones who, 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 who hear the lectures and, we, and nothing is affected by it? You know? Yani, subhanallah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala describes the people who, who have, for their heart, 
is hard. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala وَعَرَضْنَا جَهَنَّمَ يَوْمَ إِذٍ لِلْكَافِرِينَ أَعْرَضَ الَّذِينَ كَانَتْ أَعْيُنُهُمْ فِي غِطَاءٍ عَنْ ذِكْرِ When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala describes the people who, who, who the disbelievers in the hereafter, He tells them that the, the, their heart, their eyes used to be blind. Their heart, and why? Is it because they don't usually used to see? No, they used to see. And that's why my dearest Fatima says that you know, in, in Islam, real blindness, you know, real blindness, and real uh, 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 and not be able to hear is not is not the is not is not see not seeing with our eyes and not hearing with our ears, is the blindness of the heart of the heart, is worse. Is blindness of the heart is even is even even worse, you know. And this is something, my dear respect brothers, we 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 have we have to think about. When another 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 description in Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, يعني would would you know. A description of a hard heart, you'll see their tongue, yani, careless, you know, they, it say, says what, whatever they want, you know. Uh, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam described some people and he, and he said, وَإِنَّ الْعَبْدَ لَيَتَكَلَّمْ بِالْعَبْدَ مِنْ سَخَطِ اللَّهِ لَا يُلُقِ لَهَا بَالًا يُهُوِ بِهَا فِي نَارِ جَهَنَّمْ A man would say one word, one word, and he would be thrown into the hellfire for many, many years. Many, many years. One word. And that's why people like for people, for people who make fun of other people, or people who joke of, of other people, people who, who who try to put down other people. One word, one word, and that's what and that's for man, man, and that's why we have to be careful, and we have to evaluate ourselves. Are we among the people who are their heart is hard? That's the question that you need to ask yourself. Not affected, not sensible, not you know you know he he, he knows Allah Subhanahu wa Taala is looking at him. Yes, we don't care. He knows, he knows that there is going to be hellfire, yet they don't care. They know that there is going to be a punishment in the hereafter. They don't care. So this is, this is my dear respect, brother, is, 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 ex is extremely important, you know. And that's why, uh, uh, let me kind of give you this an example, so you, could, so you could understand what does it mean when, the, when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala punish people who have, whose their heart is hard. What, is, what does it mean? Is the fact that, let, let me give you an example. Exam uh, imagine if someone is, is upset. You know, sometimes they do crazy things. I mean, when people really get, get re, really raged and raged, and they're very very upset, sometimes they do crazy things. You know, and sometimes you know, even Islamically speaking, we don't we don't uh, you know so many things. You know, we don't account when someone is is angry. For instance, we don't we don't take you know if they swore. We don't. We don't. In Islamically speaking, we don't. We don't take that his oath uh, very seriously. If they, even if they made talaq, you know, he does. He divorced his wife. We don't take that seriously because this man is is upset, and sometimes he does not even. He have no control over himself, and that's why the same thing apply even apply to the people who are, who who are, who, are, who are Allah subhanahu wa taala have sealed their heart, who ha, who, are, who are affected their heart. And etc. So, my dear respect, brother, this is, this is something that we need we need to think about. I mean, sometimes people their hard, their hard is very hard, hard it's very affected and very sick and very immersed in, in, in all these sins. Sometimes Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will punish them to the point what happened, to the point that their heart, as Ibn Al Qayyim, may Allah Subhanahu wa Taala, the scholars, he said, their heart would be would have masikh on it. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala would change it to another creation. And he, and he said, وَمِنْهَا مَسْخُ الْقَلْبِ فَيَمْسُخُ كَمَا تُمْسَخُ الصُّورَةِ like Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would change his heart just like you would change a picture, you know. Sometimes he would have, a, he's a human being, but he have a, a heart of a dog. Or he would have a heart of, of a lion, or a heart of a snake, or a heart of, of a pig, you know. And, and we see this, and we see this. People, people have no jealousy. People, you know, they, they're like monsters. In the way we, they behave with other with, with other individuals, people who are careless, and yani even the animals have more mercy on some on, on, on some people more than some of these human beings, and the way they kill them, and the way they are, and, and, and how evil they are, Subhanallah. And that's why, and this is true, this is true, you know. For Subhanallah, this is something that we need to think about. And, and, and this is this is this is the translation of uh, Sufyan ibn Uyayna, and he said that this is Allah Subhanahu wa Taala have mentioned that in the Quran. In which he said, وَمَا مِنْ مَا مِنْ دَابَةٍ وَلَا طَائِرٍ وَلَا مَنْ دَابَةٍ فِي الْأَرْضِ وَلَا طَائِرٍ يَطُيرُ بِجَنَاحِهِ إِلَّا أُمَنْ أَمْثَالُكُمْ Like Allah Subhanahu wa Taala have created many people, many many animals like you, you know. Meaning that sometimes sometimes people their hearts can be changed to the point that they they would act like animals. Subhanallah.
And this is something, my dear brothers and sisters, it's, it's extremely dangerous, you know. Yeah, so, some, sometimes, yani, yani, we have to be careful, my dear respect, brothers, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would not, not go on to seal our heart, in which that nothing, nothing, nothing affects us. And, 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 and we, we will be far away from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, كَلَّا إِنَّهُمْ عَنْ رَبِّهِمْ يَوْمَئِذٍ لَمَحْجُوبُونَ Indeed, that they have, that they, they, they have a, you know, a seal between them and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And what is the seal? It's our own sins. You know, in which that we sin and we sin, we sin and we make distance between us and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You know, so, my, so my, my, with that being said, my dear respect, we don't, and some people even, they're proud of this. Yeah, subhanallah in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that some people, their, their heart is sealed and, they, and, and they, they're proud of it. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَقَالُوا قُلُوبُنَا غُلْف And some people, he's like, oh, our heart, our heart is sealed, you know, you, you, you don't give up on us, don't, don't worry about us. Our heart is sealed. I mean, you, you see, some some individuals, they know that they, they are, they, they, Allah Subhanahu wa Taala have punished them with with the with the hard heart, and their heart is sealed, and yes, they're proud of it. You know, you know. وَقَالُوا قُلُوبُنَا فِي أَكِنَّةٍ مِمَّا تَدْعُونَنَا إِلَيْهِ Like we cannot even understand. We're not at the level that you will be able to 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 to, to advise us. So just give up on us, because our heart is sealed. But my dear respect, brothers and sisters, you know, these are unfortunately the description. Of those who are hard is hard. I hope Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not punish us with this punishment. Inshallah, stay tuned that we'll be able to, inshallah, learn more about this with Allah ta'ala. I hope that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would make our hard life, our hearts, you know, living by, by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and obedient to Him. So, Allah, and, and, and we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to, 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 to make our heart and our body safe from this kind of punishment. جزاكم الله خير ما الله سبحانه بلس يو اند ريورد يو السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته